Remember all those talking paintings in Harry Potter? Well, we're coming closer and closer to that becoming at least somewhat of a reality. Nice to meet you. I am Nelly. Last year, genealogy company MyHeritage launched a feature called Deep Nostalgia, which lets users animate pictures of their deceased loved ones. So you can watch people in old pictures look around, nod, and blow a kiss. It's cool, but also a little bit creepy. Now that same company is launching a feature called Live Story, which animates a person's face and mouth so it looks like they're telling their life story. So now you can watch your great-grandparents tell you about where they grew up and what they did for a living. Those narrations are accompanied need by photos to help tell the story. All in all, they gave me 11 grandchildren whom I loved very much. It's all through a collaboration with a startup called DID, which uses AI and deep learning to create these video reenactments. The reason we decided to, to do this uh, product is because of, uh, uh, with, with this partner is, uh, of course, we, because of the success we previously had with the deep nostalgia. To make your own live story, you'll need to create an account on the MyHeritage website. You can also download the app on the App Store or Google Play. Then you can upload pictures and write text for the AI animation to read. You can choose from 31 different languages and hundreds of different synthetic voices, or you can upload your own audio recording. Hi, I'm Mary Jones. It's so nice to meet you. If you happen to have a family tree on the MyHeritage site, you can create a live story from the photos that are already there. Using the information on file, Live Story will automatically generate a narrated video with a synthetic voice generator. You'll have the option to customize the video by adding pictures or editing the text. Samantha, my darling great-granddaughter. Although we have never met, I feel that we are perfect soulmates. After that, you can watch, download, and share the video with friends and family or post it on social media. You'll get a limited number of free uses, but if you want unlimited access to live story, then you'll need to upgrade to a MyHeritage complete plan, which costs $240 a year. My first thoughts when I heard about this feature were one, this is slightly unsettling, and two, it would be really easy for somebody to misuse this and make someone say something lewd or uncomfortable. But thankfully, the folks at MyHeritage and DID have thought through that possibility and and have a set of guidelines in place to hopefully prevent misuse. So when people create their first live story, they'll see a pop-up that says, quote, I understand that the live story will be created using an AI-based lip sync technology and that is intended for use for deceased individuals only. Got it? Dead people only. Okay, next they'll have to agree that, quote, any live story I create will not include any obscene, offensive, defamatory, or false information, or any content which could violate the privacy of other people. There's also a text moderation algorithm which makes sure that people aren't breaking this rule. Perry, who's DID CEO, says that he isn't too concerned about pushback with this feature. He says when they first launched the Deep Nostalgia feature with MyHeritage last year, their algorithm found that about 95% of Twitter responses were positive. So he's hoping that there's a similar positive reaction to Live Story too. I think most of the people would uh, want to try it and uh, get uh, also and want to use it uh, again and again because it's, it's really nice. It's uh, Harry Potterizing the world. Well, we'll just have to check our Twitter and TikTok feeds to see how people really feel about it. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more content from CNET. So many moments, so many memories. I am glad I had the opportunity to share some of them with you.